The federal lawmaker representing Ipobauka Federal Constituency of Edo State in the 8th National Assembly, Honorable Johnson Agunayima, has blamed highly placed cabal for the humongous revenue loss in the oil and gas sector. The lawmaker made his allegation at the ongoing public hearing on alleged loss of over $2.4 billion on revenue from illegal sale of 48 million barrels of crude oil export in 2015, including crude oil export from 2014 till date. Plus TV Manuel Ehejene reports is presented from our studio. The ad hoc committee was set up on December 2022 after a motion brought before the House by Honorable Ibrahim Ishaka on the need to investigate the serious loss recorded by the country in crude oil sale, amounting to billions of dollars. The Speaker, Femi Bajabiamila, who was represented by Honorable Ishaka in his welcome address, stated that Sections 88 and 89, including the House rule, gave the House power to set up an other committee to investigate the alleged crude oil theft. This was buttressed by the chairman of the other committee, Honorable Mike Bila, who assured the invited organizations that the aim of the investigation is not to witch hunt, but rather to address corruption. In the light of the dwindling revenue accruing to the Nigeria from crude oil sales, it was quite alarming to learn about the whistleblower's allegations that over 2.4 billion US dollars in possible revenue by the country was allegedly lost from the sale of 48 million barrels of Nigeria's crude oil cargoes in China. While we will not allow Nigeria's commonwealth to be stolen and frittered away, we will also have to uphold the very tenets of human rights <laughs> the rule of law to say that everybody deserves a right to a fair hearing. In his submission, a former lawmaker representing Ikpoba Oka Federal Constituency in 8th Legislative Assembly blamed the huge oil theft on the activities of cabals in the country who are determined to detail the will of progress in Nigeria. Through critical NFC data and the central bank, Pre-shipment inspection report shows an undeclared crude oil shortfall of 57 million 830 thousand of Nigeria crude oil, translated to well over 17 billion dollars to the United States of America. Also, over 3 billion dollars to China, and 839,522 million 600,000 to Norway. Oriental Energy and the Nigeria Intelligence Agency were present but could not make submissions but were however given one week to make a presentation. While the NNPC, CBN, AGF, Upstream Regulatory Commission, Ministry of Finance, Account General Office and others all shunned first day of the hearing as the committee adjourned to next week. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.